Hi there. Today we're going to do an easy version of La Bamba. This is in the key of A, so it's got the G sharp third finger, high third finger on the D string, but the regular D natural on the A string. So let's get started. This song starts on the upbeat. When we count it, you count one and two and three and four and. So the and is the upbeat one and two and. So this is going to start on the and of one. So it's going to go one and two and three, four and. Ba, 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 ba. Okay? So we'll start on the third finger and then the second finger next. All right, here we go. One, two, three, and four, and one. All right, so now we start the next part same way. We go one, two, three, four, one. So I've added two more A's and a B. So A, A, B, two, three, four, one. One more time without me saying it. One, two, three, four, one. It's all right. So now comes the fun part. Hold your first finger down. I'm going to start with the B that we just left off on. So this B. And I'm stretching my third finger. You can see I've got two whole steps there. So I'm stretching that third finger all the way up to a G sharp. So B, G sharp, back to B, to D. So now my third finger's back where it normally is. So stretch and back again. So B, stretch, then back. Okay, so one, Three, one, three, and then the next part, C, B, C, A. All right, let's do that two more times. So we have C, B, C, A, and one more for good luck. One, two, three. So let's put where we do the third finger, the stretchy third finger and those last four notes together. So we have two, three, four. Let's do that again. So one, two, three, four. All right, so stop the video and practice it for a minute. And when we come, we come back, we'll put that all together. We're going to start from the beginning and play what we have so far. So, one, two, three, four, one. Rest, rest. Let's do that again. One, two, three, four, one. Rest, rest, rest. All right, so that's the end of the first part. Second part starts the same and changes at the end. So one, Two, three, four, one. Okay, and again. And this is where it changes. Okay, so it's the same notes, just faster, actually. So we have that, the B. 
Stretch the third finger out again. So we have that again. But at the end, we have D, C, B, C, A. So I'll slow that down, but then we'll speed it right back up again. So D, C, B, C, A. All right. Now at the right tempo, one, two, three, four. Okay, start from the B and Okay? Let's do that again. Ready and B So, now I'm going to start from the beginning of this second part. Remember it starts just like the very beginning did. So, 1 2 3 Four, one. Rest, rest, rest. So, there you go. Let's do that one more time. So, two, three, four, one. Rest, rest, rest. And then that part you play twice. So let's play what we have so far from the very beginning. So one, two, three, four, one. Rest, rest, rest. Rest, rest, and. the chorus. The chorus goes A, F sharp, G sharp, G sharp. So remember that stretchy third finger on the D string. I've got to reach up. Your third finger goes about an inch away from your second finger. Big enough to shove another finger in there. All right. So we have two, B, two beats of A, two beats of F sharp, and one beat each of the G sharp. So one, two, one, two, Rest, rest. Now C sharp. C sharp, A, B, B. And you do that again, so I'll just do it again. Ready? C sharp. C, A, B, B. And then A, F, B. And it goes right back. You can hear how I went right back up to the top. So let's do that again. So we have A, F, G, G. Ready, go. One, two, one, two. Now you have C, A, B, B. So let's do that. One, two, here we go. One, two, one, two. Da. Do it again. One, two, one, two. Now you have A, F, and a fast E going to the back to the top. So ready. And A, F, E. Now you can always cheat and just play A, F. So there's, I'll give you that. I'll give you that option of cheating. All right. So let's try that whole part. One, two. Here we go. One, two. One, two. Rest. Rest. One, two. And you 
can just keep going over and over again. All right, so here is the bonus, the bonus part for those of you who are feeling like you want a little bit more of a challenge. Here's the guitar riff that happens at the very beginning. So you have, I'll just play it and then I'll go back and show you how it goes. <laughs> So I'm starting on first finger on the G string, stretching for the third finger on the G string, just like on the D. First finger, D, F sharp, E. So I'll do that again. So one, three, one, D, two, one. One more time, ready, go. Starting on the third finger again, and another G sharp by third finger, back to the normal third finger on the A string, I've got one, three, one, three, three, two, one. So let's do that together, ready, and go. That's another one that's on the and of one, so one, two, three, four, one. Okay, so, and then you go and do this again. So let's put that fun little part together. So, two, ready, and. All right, one more time for good luck. Two, ready, go. All right, so now let's rock and roll. Let's play along with the backing track. I'm going to start out with that guitar riff. <laughs> I'm going to do some call and response, which means that I play and then you play what I played back. Don't worry if you can't quite get it. It's all right if you substitute your own notes for the ones that you can't quite figure out. And then after that, I'm going to let you just play your own thing. Do your own thing. I'm going to let it run. And if you stick with the notes that we've been doing... You ought to be able to make up your own La Bamba. I'm going to start with that guitar riff, and I'm going to do the both the kind of the simpler ending and the fancier ending where it's the same notes but faster. When I get to that fancy ending, you can always play the simple ending if you want. You can even simplify it even more if you want. So. Let's do it. One, two, guitar riff. All right. 
Starting on C sharp. We're gonna start on A. A again. you play on your own. Five. 